I'd like to thank all of you for joining us here for our Dancing for Our Stars, The Beat Goes On Gala. Your support tonight helps us attract and retain medical thought leaders, leading physicians, and dedicated clinicians. And it also bolsters our programs to help patients beyond the laboratories, surgical centers, and exam rooms so that they can recover and thrive. We are so very pleased to be able to make the donation to the Heart and Vascular Center as it continues to be a leader in research, equipment, and technology. Every dollar that you donate to a dancer counts as a vote for them. It is time for the entertainment. First up tonight, we have Long Beach firefighter Wayne Cheney Sr. My wife has gone through a couple of procedures uh, where she's had open heart surgery. People that are dedicated to cardiovascular are my heroes. Next up, we have Jan Rice. I was 11 weeks pregnant, and they said she had something called Turner Syndrome. She did have open heart surgery when she was five days old. The care we're receiving for Rebecca at Long Beach Medical Center has been great. We call her our feisty girl. Please help me welcome our next dancer, Marcel Epley. I went to urgent care and they, they noticed that my heart was in arrhythmia. They processed me in because it was urgent and put me on the gurney and that's where I had the heart attack. It was terrifying. We had just had an infant. I'm proud of her for hanging in there with me and doing this dance. We'd like to welcome Sophia Riley. My sister has been touched by heart issues. I'm dedicating my dance to my sister and then in my heart, my father. We'd like to also feature Bob Sensky. When I think of the Long Beach Medical Center, I actually think of all the hundreds of hours I've spent in there next to loved ones. I actually think of my father who passed away peacefully at the medical center a couple of years ago. When I think of helping your heart, I think of the Long Beach Medical Center. That's where life begins, at the birth of my twins, and where life ends peacefully. Once again, I'd like to thank all of you for making this night simply amazing. I'd also be remiss if I didn't acknowledge the extraordinary work of our Heart and Vascular Institute clinical teams. Thank you for all you do to keep our community heart healthy and strong.